Thinking inside the box can be a good thing if you want to organize your tools. And of course, we're referring to the toolbox. Proper tool storage keeps any worksite running smoothly and efficiently. And today, you can really go big on the concept with units designed for mechanics and other pros. With a professional toolbox, you'll never have to rummage around for the tool you need. There's a place for practically everything in one of these mega tool chests. It starts with a coil of heavy-duty steel. It unwinds into a punch press that cuts the metal into panels and punches holes for later assembly. Each of these panels will be transformed into a toolbox drawer. They feed the panels into an automated bending machine. It folds them on three sides to create the back and sides of the drawer. It also folds over the rim. This adds strength to the drawer and gives it a smooth edge. The assembler slides the front panel onto the drawer, then an automated welding gun reinforces the seams and secures part of the lock mechanism. To build the toolbox cabinet, a worker arranges stiffeners and lock bar grids on the back wall. Then it's over to a lineup of computerized welding guns. These guns fuse the stiffeners and grids to the panel. Each part gets numerous welds to ensure the unit really holds up. The cabinet's sidewalls are next. Workers prop them up with supports as they weld the panels to the back wall. With the toolbox right side up, they install the top. They turn the cabinet around and working from the open front, slide the lock bars into their slots. Then they build the front framework and weld ledges for the drawers to the support grid. They add a panel to the bottom end of the cabinet and weld the entire perimeter. Now it's into the paint booth, where spray guns coat everything in a layer of powder paint. The paint is tough and solvent resistant, so it will hold up to oil spills in a garage environment. They install the rest of the locking mechanisms on the front of the cabinet. Then, using a guide, press the adhesive-backed logo into place. They now snap the drawer slides into holes on the cabinet's side walls. These slides are equipped with roller bearings, which will enable the drawers to open and close smoothly. Here, they make use of the holes punched into the drawers earlier. A quick click, and the drawers are fastened to the slides. The drawers come in a range of sizes to accommodate tools of different proportions. The shallow compartments will hold wrenches and screwdrivers, while the larger ones have been made for the big power tools. Workers now encase this mega tool chest in plastic and cardboard. But this job is not quite wrapped up. They tip the unit on its side and send it down the line to get wheels. The prepackaging prevents dents and scratches along the way. A worker bolts casters on each corner of the cabinet to allow it to be easily moved around in a garage or any other work site. Add-ons can be purchased for these tool chests, so the storage possibilities are virtually endless. And that's an organizational approach that you can't really mess with.